Hey everyone, it's Melanie here from the Halton Hills Chamber of Commerce. We have another member spotlight that we're bringing to you. And this time it's with one of our newer members. So we we'll want to have a nice hello to Dr. Venkat, who's the founder and CEO of Skill Tricks Inc. Dr. Venkat, welcome to your member spotlight. How are you today? I'm doing good, Melanie. Uh, thank you for having me on this spotlight today. Yeah, you're so welcome. You and I have had a few conversations and you've got such an interesting background. So I thought that we would start with that. So you just recently completed your PhD. Do you want to tell us a little bit about what your PhD is in and, and how that led to founding Skill Trips? Uh, yes, Melanie, definitely. Uh, so getting a PhD was always my passion and, and I really worked hard for it. Uh, but I, in the process of getting my doctorate program completed, I had to go a lot of, uh, you know, uh, a stressful thinking on what should my topic be all about. You know, I, I, I wanted that to stand a little different from the regular ones, you know, while uh, we know the technology is changing, so people want to uh, research about technology, how it is empowering people and all. So I thought, for organizations, leadership is very key. And, and I also believe that culture is an important component to drive success in any organization. So, mm -hmm. so I choose a topic uh, which talks about leadership and culture synergy. Excellent. So how, how in, in, in this uh, uh, age of disruption, so where everybody is going through a little or a large disruptions, uh, in their day-to-day -day, uh, life of running business. So I, I thought it, it makes more uh, sense for, for many business owners to know about how, what are the ways of synchronizing their leadership style with the, with the organization culture to drive better results. So that, that's what I studied about. And mm -hmm. I'm happy that I've came out with uh, a small framework that fits two um, different industries, um, no matter which industry you come from, mm -hmm. level of experience that you have, uh, if you are in a leadership role and you understand culture is an important component that drives results for any business, yeah. uh, this framework will really help you drive those results and, and, and still be successful. Excellent. Okay. So there's, I feel like there's a lot of meat on the bone with that. So, you know, if I am a, uh, a fellow Halton Hills chamber member watching this and, and I'm kind of intrigued, what kind of services do you offer at skill trips? Do you want to give us a couple of examples? Right. I'll, I'll keep it pretty simple, uh, Melanie. So uh, skill tricks is a growing and, and we are establishing our presence. So, uh, what led to the foundation of Skilltrix is, so again, my uh, effort in, in getting my doctorate program and bringing that leadership and culture synchrony between both of them. I, I have later thought, okay, why, why not I scale this for, for a larger group of people or companies? And, and apparently I got an opportunity to uh, have uh, uh, the opportunity to work with uh, Halton Chamber of Commerce. So in, to, in straight, uh, the skill tricks, at skill tricks, we just design uh, strategic talent solutions that elevates organizations' performance and individual career growth. Okay, so, so what particular, you know, most people look for leadership coaching or for management coaching because they have a problem to solve. So what kind of problems do you help solve? Uh, in, in today's disruptive world, uh, transformation has become uh, the most important factor now. To, to live in, in this competitive world, we have to transform ourselves either as an individual or as a business to, to become successful. So skill tricks comes in that specialization area or where we specialize in business transformation by providing strategic guidance and, and tailored solutions that drive, uh, I would say, meaningful change. So okay. change is everywhere and and a lot of changes in technological innovations are forcing, if not, even if I don't want. So, so I've been forced to do or uh, to make the transformation to uh, stay in the competition or, or become successful. That's where we help businesses rethink their processes. You know, what, what, what we were doing yesterday may not be good enough for today or, or it may not help us move forward for tomorrow. That's where we come in and, and help businesses rethink their processes, develop new strategies on 
where you can go and pitch in for more business or how do you uh, engage your customers or how do you delight your customers i would say i like mm. this word called delight mm. <laughs> so delight okay. your customers and to in order to delight your customer how do you empower your teams to adapt and and therefore thrive in this rapidly evolving market okay so so, so if i were to reach out you know if i was the owner of abc company what what could I expect? What are what would next steps be if I was if I if I had a problem that I wanted to solve in my organization? Well, uh, so if you are approaching skill tricks, so we, we, like I said, uh, I, I have come up with a framework from my doctoral study. So I would be very more than happy to apply that, which primarily starts with customizing our services. First, by taking the time to thoroughly understand each client's unique challenges, goals, mm -hmm. and of course the industry dynamics, right? Because like I said, my framework is suitable to multiple industries. So my first client can be from anywhere. Now, even it could be from Halt and Chamber of Commerce. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so understanding those, uh, to understand those industry dynamics and, and like every company has their unique challenges and goals, we start with uh, the thorough understanding of that, which in my framework, I call it as awareness. Okay. And then we, and we do and conduct an in-depth consultations to identify specific needs and and and, and then tailor our uh, strategies accordingly, which I would call in my framework, I call it as uh, we did with awareness and and this is called uh, acceptance. Okay. So so the, when I say acceptance, okay, I might have a lot of uh, you know experience in in a specific or, or different industries, but the acceptance is that, Accepting the fact that what specific needs that this company really requires. Mm -hmm. you know, acceptance from both of us. Now, I should be accepting as a solution provider to make sure that, okay, this is what the business requires. Mm -hmm. and, and the third one is uh, alignment uh, in, in my framework. So I call it a 4A framework. And the third A is alignment. This is where we look into the uh, requirement of any personalized training programs or creation of any bespoke uh, leadership development initiatives, or even tailoring some operational improvements. That's where our design uh, piece of solutions come into picture and how they perfectly align with the business objectives of, of our clients. So therefore, the, that is the third A. And then fourth one is the action. This is where everything happens. No? Mm. The, the combination of all three happens with the fourth A, which is action, that is where our personalized approach will ensure that our clients receive targeted, effective support that drives the real results for them. Great. Wow. That's so we, we, are, we, are, we are primarily focused on uh, driving, uh, you know, long-term growth. Yeah. Okay. And so what kind of, so I'll, I guess I'll finish off with, you know, how can we help you? What kind of companies are, are you hoping, are you looking for larger companies? Who, who is your target client? Uh, I love to take up on larger companies, but you know, larger companies' org structure is is different, and and sometimes uh, they do most of it in house. But mm -hmm. The most of most of these uh, services would be required for, in my opinion, would be required for small business groups. Okay. Now, uh, some may some might be like us who are growing. Mm -hmm. may not be able to afford full-time uh, strategic uh, roles mm -hmm. to help them drive their business. Now, that's yeah. where we come in to help small businesses and develop the customized strategies that, that aligns with their goals, mm -hmm. uh, whether it could be uh, with them expanding their market reach or few people may want to improve their operational efficiency or, yeah. or want to enhance their customer satisfaction or customer delight, like I said. Yeah. So our approach is personalized to meet unique needs of uh, every business. So okay. to, to, to sum it up, uh, Melanie, I think if, if you look at a broader perspective, uh, these days companies are of five types, in, in my opinion. So uh, one is the startups who are for just starting up uh, to, to set up their business operations. And, and the second category I would say is someone who's got disrupted uh, by, by any changes in their industry or mm -hmm. any changes in technology, everything. And, and most of these companies today are might be struggling with coping up with their performance. Mm -hmm. Right. And and because of 
because of these three factors, and there could be possibilities of change in leadership. So companies which are undergoing leadership changes, mm-hmm. right? And 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 finally, there there could be a company which wants to transform themselves. Mm-hmm. So if if a if given all the companies today in the world would put into any of these five categories, the Skilltix can help and uh, come come and help them uh, to resolve their problem or or align their goals with the, align the solutions with their goals and then help them become better. Great. Wow. So um, I'm going to let everyone know that we'll be including your contact information, including your website uh, in the, uh, just below the video. And um, I guess people can reach out by email or see you at an event if they have any questions about how you might be able to help your company. Right. Our email is pretty easy to remember. It's just collaborate at skillfixinc.com. Okay, that's pretty easy. So, so, so we want to collaborate with people. We want to collaborate with other businesses and help them grow so so we can grow. Yeah, no kidding. You're going to support them so they can support you. I love that. That's so great. Well, thank you so much for joining me today. I'm sure we could have kept talking forever. It seems like you're, you know, you've know you got a lot of information that you can help people with, which is awesome. So I encourage everyone to reach out to Dr. Venkat at Skilltrix to see how he might be able to help your company. Thanks for joining me today. Thank you, Melanie. My pleasure.